Iran is not a country I can make a video of just everything, especially the kind of things that I like to visit. I've been a bit careful, but I don't think there's anything secret in this valley here except this place, which is known as the Eagle's Nest or the Assassin's Castle. And I think over there with this little cart there's a way up. And from the castle on the hill here, Hassan Sabah established a center of power for Ismaili Islam. And Ismaili Islam, I will not go into the details, but it was different from Sunni Islam because they disagreed on the succession of Islamic authority. And from here, they had a center of power. And when the Crusaders encountered the warriors that lived here in this castle and in other castles in this valley, um, they named them, they nicknamed them those who smoke hash or hashashim because they fought so little fear of death that the crusaders thought they must be high on hash. They also said they had secret gardens hidden here amongst the mountains where they could freely drink, smoke and make love to beautiful women and that's what kept them motivated to fight so hard. We didn't find a way to these secret gardens unfortunately <laughs> but we did find a way into Alamut Castle, the Eagle's Nest following these stairs on the cliff's edge you should be able to get in there Of course it's not an adventure without eating fruit straight from the trees and this time we've got cherries with a wonderfully ripe one look at it bright red in the sun mmm that's so good now, now the main occupants of the castles are lizards and this one is quite a big specimen look at this guy oh there he goes scared of me obviously but I don't know who would win in a fight with this huge one initially and the Ismailists that lived in this castle were under the banner of the Fatimid Caliphate a strong power in the Middle East in general but later they split off from the Fatimids and their power waned their fervor and their warrior spirit didn't diminish though even though they didn't have strong standing armies anymore they kept up the fight their methods changed to guerrilla warfare and assassinations in the 13th century the castle was surrendered to Hulegu Khan the leader of the Mongols that ravaged this area of the world and the castle was destroyed but the assassins they left their legends and their stories behind here and in the west and still we remember the word assassin in the English language as a hitman because of the tactics they used in the later period well filming in Iran is not the easiest place so I'm not sure where my next video will be from but I'm sure I will see you next time for the next video